Hello everybody, my name is Unit 13, Special Smile Cry, and today this is the sixth part of Inside the Crosshairs. Mind you, yes I know, I, I went sort of out of order with it, but I left this scope as last because I had to try to find information or ask people how to read it. Really, there 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 is none that I... The closest I came to finding information on it is the Boone and Crockett Big Game, uh, Big Game Rectical by uh, Leopold. That's 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 what I found. And basically, um, get right in. Well, hope, well, let's get right into this first before I start uh, reading and not even showing. Let's go. Alrighty then, so okay, these little hash marks right here, this one, one, two, right here, I'm putting on the head zip target, that I believe is, just for simple fact, this larger one here is in the 50s, so I'm going to assume and just guess that these are in the 25 yard range. And these black horizontal, I mean black, yeah, the horizontal lines here are, the thicker ones are 200 yards. And um, this, this click, this long click right here, slash chevron, slash, uh, yeah, click. Tick, Chevron, that's 300 yards. Larger one, longest one right here is 400 yards and this is 450, the smallest one, the bottom. And basically the way it looks like, this rectangle is just like the ACOG, the PSO-1 and the PKS-07 scope rectangles. There is no easy way to read it, like for instance, I did with the uh, 20 times scoping of angle where you had, where, say your target is at 400 meters and um, you uh, dope your scope at 200 meters. Yeah, you got your scope doped at 200 meters and your target's 400. You just go, you just move, you know, two clicks up full clicks to hit the target. That's this. Uh, well, while I'm sitting here hitting targets, I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, the next sub part in this series. That's going to be aerial sniping because this is the last scope for sniper rifles and it's done. So this is the last one and um, what I'm going to go into is the aerial sniping which is basically going into negative lag, negative lead. Um, I'm going to try and catch, I'm not even going to try, I'm going to do it from different people's perspective because I'm in a Milsim clan and um, that's one thing we do is uh, we train hard on sniping. So I'm going to catch it from, you know, my perspective, my point of view, their point of view, their perspective, uh, the spectator modes, uh, perspective and point of view. Just basically a 360 all around for it. Because uh, that's something I, I really like doing when the beta came out. Because I only had uh, one good uh, pilot, man. The communication between us was flawless. He was flawless in his flight. I mean, I can hit target after target after target. And you know when you're in the little bird you know and they killing the pilot is uh you know taking out enemies you taking out enemies both of you guys are scoring points ridiculously so it works out great but um hit that's what's going to be next in this uh series here is we're going to do aerial sniping 
as I said, I'm going to involve more people in, inside the process in, in this series for that because that's that takes a lot of concentration. It takes a lot of a lot more skill than just doing what I'm doing right now. Hey, well, that's about it for inside the crosshairs. I mean, that's it for it. You know, um, what is CL six time scope? And just to go and recap for a quick hot minute. All right. These small little chevron ticks here are 25 yards. Horizontal, vertical, the larger, thicker, darker lines are 200 yards. This is 200. I mean, this is 300. The large, the, the slightly long, that the longer hash mark is 300. The slightly longer hash mark is 400, and this small one here is 450 so basically 50 yards and that's about it man it's been fun with this series he has been fun love share whatever dollars I've obtained or got from either my uncle or my own and um, that's about it so for reading a reticle, it was really, really fun. I enjoyed it. It's passion of mine. And um, like I said, till next time, until aerial sniping inside the crosshair subpart series. Until then, keep it real. Keep it one shot, one kill. Smile, cry out.